Hi everybody, are you having trouble with the hangover because of the last night's heavy drinking? In Korean food culture, we have a great solution to your hangover. Drink bean sprout soup, kongnamulgogi in Korean, then you can kill the butterfly in your stomach. Cooking kongnamulgogi is really easy. In a pot, just pour water and bean sprout, boil, and that's it. So now let's go to relieve your hangover. Ingredients are so simple. Bean sprout, spring onion, radish, salt, and plain water. First step is to wash the bean sprout, but you don't have to wash that hard because bean sprout grows by watering. So in most cases, there's no dirt, no pesticide, or no chemicals. Just the rinse for safety. If you handle this bean sprout hard, and they will be hurt. Then the bad fish smell will come out. When you rinse the bean sprout, you have to handle with care. Just a soft touch and discard the water. Bean sprout is ready. Next step is to cut radish in matchstick and to chop spring onion. Actually, when you cook a bean sprout soup, Radish and spring onion is just optional. If you don't have radish and spring onion, just skip it. But if you have, they are very nice choice for great bean sprout soup. Radish, first slice this. And cut in matchstick. And now let's chop spring onion, round cuts. This spring onion will be a great garnish for our bean sprout soup. Ingredients are ready now. Okay, now let's start cooking. First, put the bean sprout in the pot. Pour all of it and pour water. This is one liter of water. And put radish together. Turn the heat on. Salt. This is one teaspoon of salt. Stir. Cover the lid, boil around 10 minutes. That's it. It's almost 10 minutes. And first taste. And then you can adjust the amount of salt according to your taste. Well, just a little more of salt. When the radish is fully cooked like this, translucent, it's done. Turn the heat off. Finally, put chopped spring onion here. And this will give a great flavor. Stir, and that's it. Okay, now I'm going to eat this with rice. Cool. Oh, Shwanada. Mm. Ah. 